One of the new features that we added in VectorCast 2024 was the ability to do CODA tests. To get going with that, what I thought I would do today is just give you some uh, example to go through to help you get started with uh, CODA test. So we have a unit test environment up right now, and what I'm going to do is just go to the options tab and be able to select the option to be able to enable support for CODA tests. Go ahead and apply that, and if I just rebuild the environment, it'll take just a second, and once that's done, we'll be able to see that the test environment has been set up uh, to enable coded tests. So that's almost done, and the environment will uh, come back up here. And we see that we have a new node uh, called coded test. So what we'll do is uh, we'll create a new coded test file. What that will do is open up a source code file for us that has some example tests in it just to get things going. All I need to do is pick a directory to put it in and uh, just name it anything we need, want to name it. Save it away. And now if we open up that source code, we can see that there are a couple of tests that have already been defined in the uh, example. And if I just go ahead and run these tests, you'll see that they are included in the test environment and uh, that they have passed. So we can look at the execution report. I can make that a little bit bigger for you. Uh, and we can see that the, uh, one of the tests here that's been selected has passed. Um, and that's all you need to get uh, coded test up and running.